How's it going everybody? My name is Daniel. Welcome to Be Castled. In this gameplay, we are going to try our best to survive by doing melee only on this game mode. So, this is Be Castled 2.0. This is our second time doing melee only. And uh, it's going to be a little bit difficult, especially with all these wolf dens that are surrounding our base. So, I'm guessing we're most likely going to have to build our castle out in a very weird way, honestly. It doesn't seem like it's going to be that good of a start, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of a horrible area to literally live at, but I guess, you know what, it's gonna be a good video because I'm gonna be able to show you guys uh, how to start out if you have a bad spawn like this, where there's only all your foods up north, where your stone that you need is down south, which honestly is kind of horrible, like, that's not the best, you don't really want that. So I'm gonna go ahead and right away we're gonna start off by getting our sawmill ready. But guys, first thing I do want to say is I want to thank each and every one of you that subscribed. We have over 400 subscribers. We're one away from 410. Like it's honestly it's kind of ridiculous. I can't I can't really believe it to be honest. It's 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 just ridiculous. It's absolutely mad the fact that we're able to hit that many subscribers such a short period honestly of been like uploading uh it's, it's it's quite ridiculous like it's genuinely just disgusting i can't believe i can't believe it like it, it I, i'm at a loss for words it's 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 ridiculous like it's, it's honestly it's just ridiculous i can't believe that i can't believe we were able to hit such a like high number it literally feels like yesterday i just hit 100 so i'm extremely grateful to each and every one of you guys that have supported me on my journey that have been here to the end like from the beginning it's it's a ridiculous feeling to have um such amazing support from the community like it's honestly just unreal honestly it's just unreal. it's kind of ridiculous <laughs> i know i know i'm saying that multiple times but it's literally just it's mad like it's so so unbelievable like, i'm quite shocked genuinely Other than me saying that, oh, we can actually put that in here. Also, um, rather than me saying that, like, I'm tr truthfully blessed with all the community, the community that I have. I'm so thankful to the, the devs of Be Castle for allowing me to play their game and test it out because it's literally helped grow my channel an insane amount. Like, a ridiculous amount is because I'm able to play this game here. So, huge shout outs to every single one of those people that work on the this game because like it's 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 ridiculous like it's just ridiculous i can't believe it but enough of me um you know enough of me talking like that it's time to play the actual game and just jump into it so what i want to focus on right away is i want to build up a little tiny castle like i want a little castle it's nothing big and fancy i want it to be a little tiny and, and beautiful like that's all i want i don't want nothing nothing too big and with that, so I'm gonna do a lot of wood. I'm gonna try and gather a lot of wood. That way we can't have walls up. We're not gonna have any ballistas or anything like that because we're gonna do melee only. It is very hard to do this may this mode as well. Uh, melee only is kind of quite difficult, but I feel like I'll be able to do it no problem. One thing I still think is a negative towards the game, um, because everybody has opinions. I think um, only playing at a one speed is kind of horrible like all the time i understand it's still just the uh, early release and all that the game's not coming out till 2021 in december so next month sometime or even may i don't know if it's next month i think it said february honestly but not for a long time but guys if you got to play the game before the demo closed which is today the last day to play it was today um let me know how you guys thought of it let me know what you guys thought let me know. give me some like insight on it because i truly love this game it's been a blessing it's kind of ridiculous again like i said it's quite ridiculous how much love uh the community has been giving me towards this channel uh and towards this series of games so it's kind of it's just it's insane let's go ahead and bring our people over here because we're gonna get attacked most likely from this area it looks like because the banner's here i'm gonna grab you and you're gonna go work in here we're gonna get a lot more wood hopefully which is gonna really help us out I could upgrade one of these houses, which I'm going to, because that's going to increase our people. Therefore, we're going to get a lot more wood, and uh, things are going to go quite well. Our production is 60, and our consumption is 70. That's not the greatest, 
We're definitely gonna need a lot more food than that. But for now, I feel like... Oh, now it's consumption 80. Oh, that's just lovely. So I guess I'm gonna have to buy this land here. And we are going to have to build a farm once we get 200 food. Which really won't take that long, honestly. It shouldn't take too long at all. And then that's gonna increase our food gain by 20, I think it is, by person. So we have... How many people here? We have three people here, and we can upgrade that once we hit 20, which isn't too bad. And then I think the same thing up here, really. So let's go ahead and get this farm put in. I'm gonna try to put it as close to the farm as I can. So I'm gonna put that there. Somebody's gonna get building, which will be quite nice. And then they're gonna work on that area. This place is gonna be quite deadly, so whenever they attack from that side, I'm gonna have to wait till nighttime to send my warriors out. But I wanna build this little tiny square here entire area here i want to board it off with walls the stuff on the outside i don't really care about are people trying to defend it but our main castle is what i worry about if this stuff can break it's fine i'll just rebuild it um but that's how i'm gonna kind of take this right now so we're gonna grab you mister and you are going to work here and then we can go ahead and upgrade this i will say yeah let's upgrade you and that's gonna allow us to get a little bit more food our production is now at 100 and we consume 80 for we at night time it looks like you consume pretty much everything which is kind of nasty but oh well but let's go ahead and see what's going on over here are people going to get attacked they should be completely fine maybe one person will go down we'll get a chapel as soon as possible that way people come to life but i want to get a tavern none of our people died which is actually ridiculous it's kind of OP. heck yeah let's go we're going to try and get a tavern right now it's actually a really good idea Let's do that before we do anything else. Get a tavern up here. Put it right in the dab smack in the middle of the town. Boom, right there. That's gonna look nice. And then we can upgrade this house as well. It's gonna give us a new villager. Uh, we can zoom 80 where we produce 100, which is pretty perfect, honestly. That's pretty awesome. But yeah. Um, my only fear with my channel is once I stop playing Bee Castle, <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna lose a lot of subs like i don't think a lot of people are gonna stay unless you guys do like the content i bring which would be you know quite amazing but as long as i don't ever go under 100 i think i'm happy because my goal was to hit 100 and we've times it by four which is just ridiculous so that's kind of it's genuinely just unbelievable i can't believe that like, it's, it's quite flabbergasted i'm quite flabbergasted we you're gonna work there that's gonna increase our those it's going to bring us up to 11 people we're able to have that means we're going to need more food but we can put a person there and in there as well which is going to help us out so you my good sir go work in the field and now consume 100 and use 100 i think that's because he already works on there he doesn't nice there we go fantastic now i have nine wood i want to get focused on my military walls and everything situated right off the bat so that's what we're going to do we're going to put a wall here here we're gonna have to wait now for the next wall we could get a tower in just to you know have it we could do ballistas in this map for melee only because technically it's just no archers we could try that um but i do i just don't want to build archers at all for this one i think it's gonna be kind of fun and uh, it's gonna be a little bit difficult so that's, that's what we want we want it to be a little difficult we want it to be enjoyable so now i need 150 wood for that we could get a well in here just in case our town tries to burn down uh, it's probably really good. Now I can put a house on up this house facing the other way. Uh, so that way. And we'll get another house and we'll have to the left as well. If we need more food, we can get a hunter's cabin going in up here. Which isn't too bad. Uh, we do need to work on our military though, so getting a barracks is probably really important. Now that I think of it, it's probably very important. Uh, especially because everything that's about to happen is going to be traps they can add mounts like they can do so much like you can have a main leader like that rides a horse or something like that like a cavalry you can do a lot of really cool things with this game i'm gonna put this right here i think that's gonna be a really nice spot for it so we're gonna do that 
that, but there we go. Our wall is now built up. I'm gonna put one knight up here just cause, cause why not? Why not? You are the you're the watchtower guard. You're gonna go stand up there and you're gonna look amazing up there. That's just gonna happen. So we got our one dude over here building like an absolute beast. The only person that's building our tower, which is fantastic. Uh, what else could we upgrade? We could upgrade some stuff. I don't think we need that. Although we could technically build it. We just need 300 wood. Can we do it? Do we put a do we put a trip machine? I don't, I don't see why not. Yeah, it's melee only, but I feel like it'd be pretty good. Getting a trebuchet pretty early, I think that'd be pretty useful. Especially since we're gonna need somebody to cast stuff down because being a melee only game is quite difficult. Um, this guy, you are going to get promoted to working here now, so we're gonna get a lot more wood, which would be fantastic. Uh, our next people, I think, are gonna start turning into our swordsmen. And yeah, I think we're gonna do what I said. We're gonna get now, I do need this plot, I just realized, because we are about to run out, which is freaking horrible. Production zero. What? It would really, really, it'd really be nice to tell me how much I'm producing, but this we're going to have to keep an eye on, because I didn't even notice that right now, it's quite horrible. Let's go ahead and bump this up, put in another person here. Probably bump this up, put in a person there as well, just for now, just to try and increase our stuff. Uh, but once we can afford it, we're going to go ahead and get the sunstone workshop as fast as possible because our people are going to die off. That's what happens. Your military will start dying once your money goes negative, basically. So, how much do I need? I need 300 wood. That's not too bad, honestly. But yeah, I think we'll be pretty good. We didn't have too big of a struggle. We got our little town getting built up, which looks actually really cool already. I love this game. Like, every time, if you guys have watched any of my series before towards this game, I don't really say much negatives at all towards the art style or anything like that because it's, a, it's beautiful. Like, it's genuinely such a beautiful, beautiful game. Like, it's actually such a beautiful game. Now, did I buy that one? I'm guessing I did. I did. Therefore, we need a little bit more. I'm gonna grab my military here. We're gonna put him out in the sun. Now we're gonna grab the sunstone area. We're gonna turn it around like this. Put it right there, which is perfect. That's actually exactly where I want it to go. Now, in order for us to build it, I'm gonna take somebody. I'm gonna take you take you because you're not really doing much at all. Take you and do that. I'm gonna grab one of our miners down here and gonna bring him up here as well because he's gonna work in this area instead. That way our military can survive because it is now the second night, which is kind of insane but it's not a second night and we are running out of sunstone which isn't good so let's kind of get these guys over here and get them situated so it's gonna help us out with a lot you're gonna chill here now you are no longer going to be a stone miner you're going to be a money mine oh you're done for the night okay goodbye bye have a good time now we got a huge wave of people coming in which is kind of scary if I can drag them this way, possibly, I might be able to bring them away from the mine that we just built up, because it would be quite nice to not have them attack that. This is kind of like a little cheeky method. You can do this cause to delay time. So technically, I can't lose any of my people if I just run them away, but I need to keep them interested in me. So we don't go ahead and attack. Oh, wait, I have a trooper shield. Oh my god. circles around them so the trebuchet would take care of it. Big brain. That's a big brain play right there. You are a miner, you are now going to go over here and fix this up. And we're going to grab a lumberjack as well. And we can come over here and get ready to start with a new job. That was actually really funny that I did that. Holy wait, the, I can't believe that. That's so troll. Let's boost this up so we can get a new person in here. Well, and therefore we are now going to go with an income of 200 already. Fantastic, that's what we needed. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, I think this is the one that I took somebody from. And then I took somebody from the mining over here. But honestly, I'd rather upgrade this one. I would love to take you and put you in here. Is our food okay? Our food consumption is not 
Start building up some of our people here. Let's do that. It took up a lot. Oh well, that's fine. Who cares? Ugly. Now, when they're done being built up, that's where they're gonna go. I want to grab my military. They're over here. I'm gonna put them over here now. I would like to get these walls built up as well. This is pretty much how our base is going to look. Go that way. That's gonna be our basic. It's gonna come along here. It's gonna be like a little diamond kind of shape, not diamond, like a triangle. That's how it's gonna be. Where's our arms? I feel like I feel like I scammed down or they're over there. Okay. I was like, where the heck did these two come from? But that one guy he just wasn't paying attention. The other one was just me from over here. Not too bad there. Let's go ahead now and build up another house. walks through that house. Maybe he lives there actually. Comes out the back will be very confused. But maybe that's his home. It's not a bad little time. But yeah guys, tell me how your day's been. Tell me what you've been up to. Have you guys played any of Be Castle at all? And if you have, let me know how you enjoyed it. I love this game. This game's super fun. Again, like I said, my only worry is what's gonna happen when you stop playing Be Castle because it's gonna get to the point where we're just doing the same thing over and over again, which it already is hit. It's like our fifth or sixth season. And yeah, we pretty much do the same thing. We just try to do little challenges, which is pretty fun. And we try to do different things. Like, I could always do one where we could try surviving without a military. That would be kind of interesting. Uh, I don't know how the heck we would do that, but that's something we could always try as well. It would be kind of crazy. Now, our people, they heal up on their own, which is awesome. Because that means I don't really need a chapel right away. That guy, I don't know what he's going to do, but let's try to get our people focused on building up our walls. So I want that wall there. It's just got a lot of wood, but that's fine. We have a ton of people that are able to bring it in for us. You guys are kind of waiting for trees, which sucks. There we go. This is gonna be. This is gonna be like the first castle that we're actually gonna properly fully build. Because last time we didn't even get to do that. Now I do need people to go work over here. We have three builders for some reason. Can I get you to go over in that farm? Hopefully that's gonna bring us up a little bit. If not, we can go ahead and capture this land up here. Where we're going to hunt the deer, which will be, which will be quite helpful. Now we can put a we'll put a wall in right here, and with that, oh, you can change the wall size. You can make it a double, make the wall double sided. That sounds interesting. I would like to figure out what that is. We're negative 142 wood because I clicked that. fix itself now or did I just screw the game by accident? Oh no. Doesn't look like we're getting any wood either. No, because they can't chop outside their zone. Yeah, that sucks. Oh, that's okay. I'll have to wait a little bit. But once those trees grow, they'll start chopping like they are now. So yeah, yeah, it fixed itself. Okay, it was just a glitch on my part. No worries there. Now like I said though guys, if you do want to recommend games to me, a lot of people have been recommending games. It's just, if I own it already, then I can have a chance of recording it. But if I don't, it's going to kind of suck because I have to wait and pay my rent first before I do anything else. But um, let's try to see what we got going on here. Our food is actually really nice right now. We could do that. 
but that's gonna be kind of troublesome in a way because we're not really able to chop much trees down when there aren't really any trees anyway. So what we could do is we could put no we don't really own any areas that have the have what we're looking for. I guess we can kinda of chill for now. Let's get this little area here. Board it off, which is gonna take a lot more to do. Now our people here we're going to bump up as many of them as we can for the next one. We are consuming a total of 56, where we have a total of 200 income, which isn't honestly bad at all. Let's get these guys to rally up out here. Again, we'll probably put a gate out here as well, that way we have two entrances and two exits so far, and then maybe we'll put one up here as well, or maybe two, just to kind of make it look nicer. But guys, after this night, I think I'm going to end the episode. It's been already 20 minutes because it's too shabby. But all I say, this game is so freaking beautiful. I love this game. If you haven't played it, I feel bad for you because you guys just missed the demo. It ends today on the 24th. I did record this today. So if you guys did miss it, I feel bad for you because it's such a, such a great game. It, like, honest to God, it's actually such a beautiful, beautiful game. Yeah, people are going to get pelted. Which sucks. I would love for them to like, get back in and just mess up the archers. But down they go instantly. Oh no, we're gonna lose our mind. That's okay. It's fine. Well, if we had a ballista or anything like that over here, I think we would do much better. But they're gonna take this out, which with ease most likely. Yeah, there's a lot of them. Look at them all. Oh my, oh my gosh. We done messed up. But guys, my name is Daniel. If you haven't, please hit that subscribe button. Other than that, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff down below. This is B Castle. We're going to do a melee only with ballistas series, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. These guys are shredding through everything. These guys are the smart ones. They went around. But oh my god, look at this. We still have over a minute. But let's just watch the terror. But yeah, guys, like I said, if you're enjoying it, don't forget to subscribe. If you guys didn't like what you see, don't forget, don't forget to hit that dislike button. I'm not gonna hate on you. I'm gonna be thankful to you, but these guys are gonna destroy my entire town. Oh! My ballista's hitting them. That's right, you you protect me. I'm losing a lot of really good stuff, which sucks. But you know what? That's, that's the way of life. That's how it happens when you don't have a proper base all built up and these guys just come in. That's why you need ballistas. Holy, they're literally destroying absolute madmen. Whew. That sucks. So they tore down a house, they tore down our barracks, they tore down a wall, and they tore down our, our mine for out here. They're about to tear down another house as well if my ballista doesn't hit them, which it's not going to, so now it goes to another house. Wow, wee wow, wow. They literally just destroyed us. That's crazy. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. All of us are down below. My name is Daniel. Thank you so, so much for watching. Other than that, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.